just a video of this now, Lewis. <laughs> Hey guys, it is Mark from Modern Tech and it has been 250 odd million degrees outside so everybody in the UK is currently dying. So what people do in the UK when the sun is out just the tiniest bit, we have barbecues. Yes, that is what we do. We are not used to the sun so we'll just have a barbecue every single time without fail. Should we put your um, graphics card on there, Jake? No. <laughs> My friend Jake has tried to build his PC recently and it has been sat on his bedroom floor for roughly six months because he couldn't finish it himself, which fair enough, he just couldn't do it. So naturally I volunteered to help out and what better day than to do it in a nice garden with a barbecue. Of course we're not just going to have a barbecue with two people, so my friend Lewis came round. Lewis is not a PC guy, he's a console gamer, so he was kind of learning a few bits as well himself. And we all had a pretty fun time doing this and got pretty stuffed with food. Jake's original case that he had with everything originally built in it was a Corsair 1000D, I believe it was called, and it was absolutely huge. I think it's referred to as a super tower. And Jake had completely changed his mind on having that. I think once he actually seen the size of this massive beast in his house, it was just taking up all his space. So he wanted to downgrade to a smaller size, but still keep high-end parts. So he's using his 3070, and he's got an i9 9th gen processor. And he's also got a few other little quirky components which look pretty cool for helping out with this PC Jake was kind enough to donate his old case to me which was very greatly appreciated so thank you very much to Jake big shout out for that and as this was like just a standard barbecue of a few friends having a laugh I didn't do too much voiceover talking so I will pause the video every now and again and do a little bit of description of what was actually going on just in case if some bits weren't clear on this video i will try and fill you in as much as possible so we're gonna redo all of this basically no we'll keep yeah we'll keep it up because you can get to both i sides. can unplug yeah unplug everything from the back oh my god if i move it this way a bit you can be a bit closer to it from this side it's like predator's head it's like predator's ship did you say his head <laughs> where's the self-destruct button somewhere was this not part of the case, this Jane? This fan controller? What? That extra fan that controller? That's stuck in there. Did, was that, is that actually attached yeah, to the case? Yeah, it's attached cool. to it off. It's glued on. I think we can take it off. You can see that's not super glued on, Jane. Oh, wait, not... no, that one. No, no, I don't know. I'll put it on myself. Is there another one? Yeah, there's one. Oh, yeah, no, I see what you mean. Yeah, that's. That, that one is that stuck, on. One's stuck on. Okay. Well. First thing first, I'll get everything unplugged. While this part sped up and my dog kept yapping away, we proceeded to untangle this beast. It turns out Jake had every single wire he had plugged into it, so he had two whole sets of power power supply cables plugged into each other, so there was like crazy long extensions. As you can see, there's some black and some white. And yes, we just had to unplug everything and start from scratch. Mm. That might, might, might have been why I wouldn't turn on. I think there is too much in it. Too. You've got the. You should have had enough power. You've got the yellow thousand. 850. 850? Yeah. You might have struggled with it. Is that why it might not. Yeah. Um, yeah. Have you got like a weed bag? A weed bag? <laughs> It's the, it's the first thing that came to me ahead. <laughs> he knew exactly what I meant when I said that as well. <laughs> got a wee bag. Oh, he's got a wee bag. <laughs> I, I don't know what they called, it was the first thing that came to me ahead. If I said plastic bag, it could have been anything. What's this kit? Capture card. It's a capture card, yeah. It yeah, came like with the recording motherboard, yeah. Unscrewing the motherboard and the heatsink did take a while, but luckily we did not have to take the actual heatsink off the motherboard. We could just keep them attached together because that was something I was concerned about. And 
Uh, yeah, it's doable, but it's just so annoying. I don't know if you've ever done it before, but it is. <laughs> it's just an extra step we luckily managed to avoid. Should be like a little clip on him to pinch down. Yeah, I'm pinching. I'm pinching. It's not fun. Uh, yeah, I'm pinching. It's not fun. <laughs> Do you need this one? <laughs> Some of <laughs> Not to lose my temper with it. <laughs> <laughs> Right, okay. That's everything out. You can lift it out now, Jay. Oh, no, 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 it's in there. Audio. Right, free. <laughs> you got it? Yeah. Alright. Lovely. I'm gonna say it now. Please, please clean your PCs quite often. You don't have to do it all the time, at least once every six months. Take the side panel off, give it a dust down. Don't let it happen like this. Don't be that guy. Don't be a Jake. Sorry, Jake. Clean your PC. That'll need taking off and stuff. I'm taking that out to put the other one in here. Will three fans be enough in, in this small thing? Yes. Well, yeah. You'll have the things at the top and then we'll have some at the front and you'll have one at the back as well. So we're we taking more fans out of the big one? Yeah. yeah. But I might be able to take you home, Jake, with a working PC. Yeah, hopefully. <laughs> <laughs> of course we're going to game on it. The only problem is it's a 1080 screen. Is your, what's your, oh, you've got 4040, haven't you? Yeah, I've got that at home. I might do fuck it. I know one of those is broke, you know. What a lot. The screws. Like, I kept uh, turning it around and around, it just wouldn't turn. So what you do is you get some blue tack, you put the blue tack in, and the blue tack fits in the hole where it ought to be. Okay. It hardly ever works. What the best thing to do is you get a bigger screwdriver, pushing hard and do it. Alright, I use the blue tack trick. It works, it's just like a little bit threaded, but it's not. I've, I've tried it a few times, but I've never. Has it not ever worked successfully? No, I'm not sure. That's my old last of us. <laughs> Ming in. You alright, Jay? No, I'm drunk. I'm knocking on my chair. Sorry, it's a, it's a nice chair. Okay. That that's the bracket to the case, yeah. and then mm -hmm. these ones are the power supply to the mm. bracket. Is that gonna go? Yeah, yeah. It's got to go in, but it, it fits like perfectly. As long as it but, doesn't mess around with the RAM. But it's close, isn't it? Like if I get all the wires out of the way, it's tu it's touching. Ew. Yeah, at this point, that water cooling, which was in that massive case with the three fans, it just wouldn't fit in this case. We contemplated cutting the metal bracket, which would make it fit better, which, well, it won't be completely secure, but it'll fit and it will work at the top, but it fit at the side a lot better, so we just shoved it in the front panel. That's fine. Some PCs are built that way. I prefer to put it on the top, but it just is what it is. What we're doing now is we're building and putting back together this because <laughs> he was has the illness of stupidity and bought one that was too big for him. What does that say about my size? It's very small, Jeff. Mm. <laughs> Ready 
at this point rather than making the extra work of taking each one of these fans off the cooler and turning them around I decided to cable tie up the loose cables at the side yeah it's not going to look the best but it does the job and it looks okay remember it was 10 million degrees Does that do the same? Does that just lock in as well? well I'll leave that for a second. We just want to make sure it turns on. And three, two, one. I'll press the button. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, shit. So right now we're nicking the fans from this beast for the computer outside. You cut a lot of your own words out though, don't you? And you, no, you, you record over it, don't you? That's the Depends. Point. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. I won't record over. GeForce RTX 3080 Ti, is that you've got in yours? <laughs> yes, it is. Sit down, Jake. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Always a bossy one. And voila, she is an absolute stunner. Considering we were working with what we've got, and it was a hot day, I feel like we managed to make her look quite pretty. And yes, it works, it is great. Well done to everyone. Well done, Jake, well done, Lewis. Both put in some work, we did it. Oh, and to make things even better, when we plug it into the TV, it's shown the first thing that popped up was a very awkward conversation of Jake trying to flirt. So that was perfect. <laughs> Michelle's Facebook chat. <laughs> Is that going on a video? <laughs> Do you like it, Fig? Do you like it? Is it good? Yeah. <laughs> you sure you don't want your graphics card on it, eh, Jake? Still yeah. time. <laughs> <laughs> if you do like this video, please consider a like and subscribe. It really, really does help. I really enjoy doing this YouTube stuff, and I hope to continue. Continue that. I hope to continue doing it more. So please consider helping out. <laughs> Smart from Watertech. Thanks for watching. <laughs>